One of our great thinkers within interaction design in Sweden, Professor Jonas Lövgren, defines interaction design as the shaping of digital things for people's use. So interaction design is not only about the technology, it is about our digital materials, but it's also about users, the people using our designs, and also about the context, the activities and practices within which designs are used. To create a successful design, all of these aspects need to be considered. To help us in this process, it can be helpful to think of interaction design as having three starting points. The technology, the needs and the ideas. Starting from technology, you may have identified a new exciting technology and try to match that with needs that users may have that could be addressed by this technology. Um, or you can start from the needs and try to identify technologies that can help you solve them in various ways. Or sometimes you may start from an ideal, for instance, to incorporate more of human capabilities in interactions such as gestures and ground that in needs and technologies. These three starting points can be seen as the three cornerstones of interaction design. Usually, a design process involves all of these aspects, but may be focused on one or two of them. That's it. <laughs>